2011, only five years later, we are on a track of having nearly 2,000 calls for this year alone. This is a 53% increase. Due to this increase in emergency call volume, our personnel are being stretched thinner and the day-to-day -day management be is becoming more and more challenging. Because of these continual challenges, the organization saw the need to expand the number of management and operational positions. Therefore, two captain positions and two lieutenant positions have been created to assist with these new and ex uh, exciting challenges. These four individuals have successfully risen to the top of a thorough selection process to determine the best candidate for these new positions. <coughs> Rob, Andrew, Tim, and Kevin, you have been chosen by the virtue of your background, training, and leadership values to be promoted to the position of line officers. Rob and Andrew, you are being promoted to the positions of captain. Tim and Kevin, you are being promoted to the positions of lieutenant. <laughs> Gentlemen, your duties now go beyond just responding to emergencies as EMTs and paramedics. As line officers, you must demonstrate exceptional character and integrity. Your decisions and actions directly reflect the image of the Harleysville area EMS. Captain Rob Roy. Rob, you have been with this organization for over 10 years. Over these years, <laughs> 15 years? 15. Over 15 years. Rob has, has served in many different positions here as, and has played an important role in both the administrative support and operational duties of, the, of this organization. Captain Rob Roy, it is my honor to present to you your Captain Bars. Andrew, has been, you have been with this organization for, for several years as well. Andrew began his career with Haynes as a part-time EMT and has worked his way up into a full-time paramedic position. Over the years, Andrew has also performed many additional duties for us here at Haynes. Captain Calhoun, it is my honor to present, with you, present to you your Captain Bars. Tim has been with this organization for nearly 10 years, and over these past few years, Tim has taken on several additional duties and projects for us here at Haynes. Tim currently heads up our training department and oversees our safety and infectious control program. Tim, Lieutenant McIntyre, it is my honor to present to you your captains, or Lieutenant Lars. I'll take your captain. <laughs> <laughs> Tim began his career here with Haynes as a volunteer member, just going through his EMT training. Over these years, Kevin has really impressed all of us here on how quickly he has excelled as an EMT and in the emergency service field. Because of this, Kevin has challenged us here at Hames, in a good way, to rethink and change some of our po past policies. Um, one of the policies Kevin influence, had an influence on was the ability to transfer from a volunteer member to a career position. Kevin, keep up the good work and don't stop challenging, giving us challenges. <laughs> so Lieutenant Wasson, it is my honor to present to you your Lieutenant Bars. Thank you. Thank you. Be more proud of you.